This is the video for lesson 24 on my website, More Complicated Edition. Before watching this video, you may want to watch the videos for the previous lessons on Basic Edition. For this example, I'm going to add 2,754 plus 478 plus 89. Now, notice how I was careful to line up all the numbers so that each place value is in the proper column. The ones places are over the ones places, the tens are over the tens, the hundreds are over the hundreds, and so on. If we don't do this, then we'll do the addition completely wrong. Now, even though we're adding three numbers, the procedure is still the same as what we've learned. I'll start on the right. We always start with the ones column. I'll add 4 plus 8, which is 12 and then I'll add 9 which gives me 21. Now if it's helpful you could certainly do 4 plus 8 which is 12 and just kind of write it off to the side just in a little scrap area and then add 9 to get 21. If that's helpful you can certainly do that. Now as we've seen before we can't fit two digits into the ones place into one single column so I'm going to write the 1 which is in the ones place and I'm going to carry the 2 because we have two tens we'll add that into the tens column. Now we have to start by adding that carried digit. So we have 2 plus 5, which is 7. 7 plus 7 is 14. And 14 plus 8 is 22. Again, I'll put the two ones in this column. And then I have to carry the two tens into the hundreds column. Now we have to be careful, since we were adding tens, the two that we really carried is really two hundreds. Make sure that you see how that works. We were dealing in the tens column, so everything is shifted over one. The two tens is really two hundreds that we're carrying. So now we're going to add two plus seven, which is nine. Nine plus four is thirteen. The three goes here. We carry the one, which is really one thousand. Because it was actually one hundred thirty. It was actually thirteen hundreds which is 1,300. That's where that comes from. We have 1 plus 2, which is simply 3, and it's actually 3 thousands. This is just a very basic example. Make sure that you feel fully comfortable with working with addition in this way. We'll learn more later.